for the public broadcasters going on so many platforms isn't a kind of waste of resources? Will not be better to focus on the main traditional ways to broadcast? Uh, it's easy to say that, but the truth is that these days you have to go where the audience is. And the audience have got very diverse tastes, and we see many of them still cling to the traditional platforms, but many others want to go to alternative platforms, particularly to social media, and therefore for public broadcasters, if they want their message to reach the public, then they need to be on multiple platforms. So an important topic in our activity as PBS is exactly to attract the young audience. But using the new platforms only, is it enough? No, I think young people are, are, are quite diverse. Our experience in the UK certainly is that some young people um, have quite traditional consumption patterns. Others have very different and modern consumption patterns, largely on social media. So I think it's necessary to have both approaches. And one last question. The BBC was always and uh, still is a world leader in journalistic good practices. What explains finally this prestige? Well, it's kind of you to say that. Um, I, I, I think um, for us, we have always wanted to be impartial and we've always wanted to be accurate. And it's those two things. And those things are more difficult these days because, as we've been hearing at this conference, there is so much fake news, there is disinformation, there is misinformation, there is malinformation. These things are a modern scourge, and therefore, for public service broadcasters, it's essential to find a way through to be able to verify the information that we put in front of the public.